Hey, 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 welcome to a new episode of Nate's MMA Corner. I am Nate, and if you watch my show, you're in my corner. Okay, uh, this episode is a post-fight show for Gaslam vs. Magni, Ultimate Fighter Latin America Season 2 finale. And, uh, wow. Yeah, I'm going to make this a quick episode because I want to get to the next episode quick. Uh, I'm trying to bust out two episodes today. Press for time. So, I'll just go down the main card, tell you tell you who fought, who won, what not. Keep it straightforward, simple. Yeah, so the main event was Walter Wade Clash with Neil Magny versus Kelvin Gastelum. Neil Magny won by a controversial split decision. A lot of people felt Gastelum should have won the fight, but the nod went to Magny, and I think, uh, I, I think you could see how Magny won the fight, if you watch closely. There, there's moments where he was he was able to push the pace still and squeak, squeak out the decision. So it was a close one, but yeah, the decision went to Magni, and I could see frustration on the face of Gaslam and the fans of Gaslam. Yeah, I could this fight, you know, you could go either way, but I could see how Magni uh, won the fight. Yeah, so Magni wins a uh, split decision over Kelvin Gaslam in the Walter Wade division. Then the co-main event was Featherweight clash with Ricardo Lamas and Diego Sanchez. Ricardo Lamas won by decision unanimous. Then uh, in the flyweight division, we had uh, Henry Cejudo versus uh, Juicier Formiga, and Henry Cejudo won by it was yeah it's split decision. This one was a pity powder match, and it was just um, a, you know a bit of a grinder match for Henry Cejudo. Good win over a big name though to get him that title shot, let's hope so. And then in the welterweight finale of The Ultimate Fighter, we had uh, Eric Montano versus uh, Enrique Maureen. And yeah, it was a split decision win for Eric Montano. Hard fought fight, could have gone either way, but I think that overall the judges got this one right. I wanted uh, Enrique to win, but it's one of those things, I mean, he didn't push the pace that last round. He didn't do enough, I think. Um, yeah, then in the lightweight finale of this card, we had uh, Enrique Barzola versus Horatio Gutierrez. And... Yeah, this one was decision unanimous. This was pretty much uh, open and shut case type of fight. Yeah, Enrique, he won that fight. I mean, clearly every round. Uh, boy, was I wrong on my pick on that one. Then, to kick off the main card, in the, also in the lightweight division, we had Leandro Silva versus Efrain Escudero. This one, yeah, I knew Leandro Silva would win. He won, yeah, decision unanimous, and I just knew that his experience would pay off. Uh, so, not that Efrain is not experienced, but just uh, Leandro had, had 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 some good, tough grinding fights in his career that I think helped him for a guy like Efrain. Yeah, so there you have it. All the fights went to a decision on the main card. I wanted to make this a quick episode so I can get to the next episode quick as I am pressed for time. So stay tuned for my next episode, which will be a pre-fight for Henderson vs. Masvidal UFC Fight Night. Well, well it's a pre-fight show, so self-explanatory there. So until then, see ya.